communities are putting new rules in place. Jesse Ritka reports from Dowsman. This is all that remains from a grass fire that started last week in Dowsman, but conditions in southeastern Wisconsin continue to stay dry, causing more communities to issue burning bans. Like most of us, Vicki Burnett is struggling to keep her thirsty lawn and garden from completely drying up. I'm dragging the hoses around and watering every square inch that I can. Most locations haven't even seen an inch of rain all month, leaving parched yards thirsty for rain that won't come. It dries up just about as soon as you water it. Southeast Wisconsin is not experiencing drought conditions yet, but the landscape is becoming dangerously dry. Uh, unfortunately, I mean, we've had obviously really dry conditions, and so that has to put some limits on what we are allowed to do, and everybody has to use responsibility. The city of Franklin, Germantown, Menominee Falls, and Oconomowoc have all issued burn bans until further notice, and that includes campfires and charcoal grills. Every community has different ordinances, but open fires usually for cooking mean that just that and like an open type grill. I keep some kind of tools nearby or hose nearby that if it does get out of control, even though there might not be a burning ban, you're able to extinguish it. And even though Dowsman doesn't have a burn ban yet, Vicki isn't taking chances when firing up her grill. Oh, I just grill in the driveway here. Hopefully I can never stop grilling. But if the dry conditions don't end soon, one of Wisconsin's greatest pastimes may come to an end for more of us in southeastern Wisconsin. On your side in Dowsman, Jesse Redka today's TMJ4. And fire departments want people to be especially careful with fireworks over the 4th of July.